hello guys and welcome back again to my youtube channel so in today's video i'm going to be making the simple but delicious pasta recipe so let's begin so here are all the ingredients first i have pasta you can use any pasta of your choice to make this next i have tomato stew but you can also use tomato paste if you don't have stew next i'll be adding tuna fish next i'll be adding ginger garlic chili pepper onions and seasoning cube i'm not going to be using all of the seasoning cube next i'm going to be adding crayfish I'm also going to be adding mayonnaise chili flakes and then the last is salt so the next step is to parboil the pasta so I love to parboil my pastas and rice before the final cooking so that's exactly what I'm doing here So now I'm going to sieve out the water, the pasta is not completely done and, and then I will prepare the ingredients. So here I'm going to be cutting the onions and I'm going to be shredding them into tiny pieces. That's how I want it for this recipe. So for the ginger and garlic and crayfish, I'm going to be using mortar and pistol to um, crush it because I don't really want a smooth texture. So 
so the next step I'm going to be adding the onions but I'm not going to be adding oil because I'm using stew and there is already oil in the stew but if you're using tomato paste then it's best to add oil and first fry it otherwise you will end up with a sour tomato taste So now I'm adding the tomato stew. Then I'm going to stir and then add the rest of the ingredients. I'm adding chili pepper. Crayfish. Seasoning cube. Salt. Now I'm adding the tuna fish. So I'm going to cover and let it steam for like two minutes. After that, I'm going to add the pasta. And I'm going to give it a thorough stir, making sure that I combine the whole ingredients with the pasta. So now I'm going to add a tiny bit of water and let the pasta cook till it's done. So after about 4 minutes and the pasta is all done. And finally I'm going to be adding mayonnaise. This is the last stage of the cooking and I added 2 tablespoons of mayonnaise and I'm going to mix and combine everything together. And 
finally guys the pasta is ready this pasta tasted so delicious like it's a must try and that brings us to the end of this video please subscribe like and share this video thank you all and see you all in my next video bye